Hey guys, this is a uh, Tiki Uchi TB170 excavator, mini excavator. It's uh, not too new. Um, it's got two buckets. It's got a uh, wider trench bucket and a thin bucket with a plate welded on it. Why, I do not know. And uh, it looks like they pulled apart here off a cat excavator so they could have the quick tats in their buckets. And, uh, Guessing it's owned by uh, Salisbury Trucking, and it says on this Kenworth truck. Um, yeah, and they've been doing some pipe work up here at the uh, Orlando site where the 30 LME is. And um, it's a nice machine. It's got a backfill blade on it, and it's uh, it's got two joysticks in it, and like every excavator, and a um, two other joysticks for the tracks. It's a small machine, not too big. But um, it's bigger than a regular mini excavator. Here's the back of it. Here's the trailer they hauled it in on. And the work. This dump truck. Um, it's a good looking machine. Here's the top view of it. Here's the tracks. Not rubber like most mini excavators. It's just big enough to have uh, metal tracks. And uh, it's got the swing like a backhoe does right here that you have more uh, advantage while you can swing both ways and um, it's a nice looking machine if someone could comment and tell me what these two buckets are called and why you weld the plate on the uh, on the bucket sometimes um, it'd be great there's the hydraulic lines plate again here's the uh, there's another view of the cab. Here's another view of that. The windshield wiper. Here's um speakers. Apparently, this guy gets radio in this excavator. Um, here is again TV 070. Nice machine. Like to operate it.